Chapter one of uh, Paperboy. I'm typing about the stabbing for a good reason. I can't talk without stuttering. Plus, I promised ma'am I would never tell what happened to my yellow handle knife. Ma'am might say that typing is cheating, but I need to see the words on paper to make sure everything happened the way my brain remembers it. I trust words on paper a lot more than words in the air. The funny way I talk is not so much like fat pigs and cartoons as I just get stuck on a sound and try to push the word out. Sometimes it comes out after a little pushing, but other times I turn red in the face and lose my breath and get dizzy circles going around in my head. There's not much I can do about it ex except think of another word or keep on pushing. The lady my parents hired me to show how to talk is teaching me to use a trick she calls gentle air, which means letting out a little of my breath before I get stuck on a word. So when I feel like I'm going to have trouble saying a word, I try to sneak up on it with a hissing noise. When you're 11 years old, it's better to be called a snake than a retard. Some days if I've gotten stuck on a lot of words at school, I'll come home and p put a piece of notebook paper in the typewriter that someone from my father's office brought to our house a long time ago and forgot to take back. The same one I'm typing these words on now. I peck out the words that gave me the most trouble for the day. My hands know where the letters are and I don't have to think up tricks to help me push out a word. I like the sound the typewriter key makes when it smacks the black ribbon because it's always the same. I never know what kinds of sounds are going to come out of my mouth if anything happens to come out at all.